What is up everybody? AJ here. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to teach you the fastest way to share and record meeting notes in Microsoft Teams. If you find this video useful, make sure you give it a thumbs up and if you really want to supercharge the way you use Microsoft Teams, hit that subscribe button as well. And with that being said, let's get into it. Starting from scratch, we're going to create a recurring meeting every week in Microsoft Teams and then I'm going to show you the best way for yourself and everyone else in that meeting to access and edit those meeting notes. So in Microsoft Teams here, I'm going to jump over to our calendar, grab a title that's free and I'm going to start a meeting with Alex. We're going to call this Weekly Sync and we're going to turn on the option of does it repeat? It is going to repeat every week. Every Thursday, it's going to repeat from 10 to 10.30 a.m. And then we're going to hit send. So in Microsoft Teams, I'm going to open up that meeting and I can hit join, but instead I want you to press on these arrows to open up all the meeting settings here. At the top here, you can actually see a bit more detail as to what's happening in this meeting. You can see the, the name of the meeting, who's invited, the details within that meeting, and along the top here where it says weekly sync, you can see your chat, your files, the details, the scheduling assistant, meeting notes, and whiteboard. We're gonna focus on the meeting notes tab today because this is where you can all access and edit the meeting notes. And because it's part of that recurring meeting, they're gonna keep updating week on week. So I'm gonna hit the option here to take notes. And what you're gonna see here, you're gonna see essentially a big wiki where you can add notes add new sections and you've got a few editing features at the top here. What I like to do is where it says notes is actually put the date. So let's put today's date, 10th of 10th of 10th, 2020, because this is our first meeting. And then this is where we can start capturing all the notes. It could be Alex's actions. And then over here we could have Alvo's actions. And maybe under that we have Megan's actions. Because it's part of a Teams meeting, everybody within that meeting can see and edit these notes. And because it's part of a recurring weekly meeting, you can actually you can keep adding and adding to this. So what I recommend is on the next weekly sync, you add a new section here, and then you change it to the 17th of the 10th, 2020. And again, you put in those same meetings and actions. I find because it's in a chronological order, you can actually copy the actions from last week you can mark off what's been completed and keep the outstanding actions there so you have this rolling history of it. If you're gonna access these meeting notes within the Teams call, simply open up the team call. Let's hit join now. At the top ribbon here we have show participants, the conversation pane, raise hands, and the ellipses. Any Microsoft program, the ellipses always means more. So if we select the more actions, the second option there is our meeting notes. And this is gonna take us to those weekly sync actions that we had. If we want to access these notes without joining the meeting, we can simply select on the calendar, find that weekly sync. Instead of joining the meeting, you want to select an arrow here and it's going to take you to all the meeting details. Up the top here where it says meeting notes, you're going to simply select on that tab and this is going to pull you into those weekly sync notes. Cool. And it is that simple to create, access and share meeting notes in a Microsoft team meeting. Hope you guys found this video useful. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you really want to supercharge the way you use Microsoft Teams, hit that subscribe button as well. Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend. And I'll see you next time. Bye.